Hi, I'm Dr. John Flukey. I'm technology editor and chief dental editor at Dental Products Report magazine. And I'm spending some time here at Vista Apex today. And I'd like to tell you about one of the products they have that I use on a regular basis in my office, pretty much whenever I'm doing a restorative case. And it's a material called Seam Free. Um, what I love about this is this is a composite wedding resin, but it is not a bonding agent. Now, a lot of us, uh, when we work, Composites are sticky and there's nothing more frustrating than you know, when you're trying to do incremental placement of a composite and you, you get the material maybe into the prep with your dispenser gun or sometimes you'll even dispense it you know, on the counter then pick it up with an instrument go to the mouth. And it's funny how many times that, especially it seems like in, in class two situations where you've got your instrument, you put that first increment down into the box and you lift your instrument away and there's the composite right on the end of it. It's like you're doing some kind of a duralay onlay or inlay prep. So you take it and kind of roll around your fingers a little bit, put it back on the instrument, go back in, place it again, lift your instrument out, and there's the composite stuck to the instrument. Happens a lot. No matter what composite you use, all composites are sticky. And a lot of people in our field will overcome that um, by taking just their bonding agent, whatever that is, that bonding resin, and they'll either put that on, uh, you know, on their table or they'll put it on the back of their glove and they'll dip the instrument in that and then that obviously decreases uh, the stickiness of the situation and makes the material go to place easier. The only problem with that is that it is a light cured material and every time you use it you are introducing you know an amount of bonding agent that then's going to set when you set that increment of composite and so you end up with kind of a sandwich of composite resin, composite resin, composite resin, depending on how many increments you need. The great thing about Seam Free is Seam Free is a wetting resin, but it's not a bonding agent, so it doesn't set. So you don't end up with this sandwich of composite resin. You dip this, uh, you know, you, you put this on your glove and then you dip your instrument into it. Once again, you can put it on the counter if you want to dip your instrument into it. And then when you place your resin, uh, you come in with your instrument and you go to put it to place. It doesn't stick, but you're also not adding that clear sandwichy layer of uh, bonding agent that you're going to get when you come in with the light. Uh, it's also something that I find really great to decrease the oxygen inhibited layer at the end of the procedure. Once I get everything to place and I've got it all carved and shaped the way I want, then I'll come in with a final coating of seam free with a little type of uh, a brush, a micro brush like this bend it, dip it in, kind of paint it over um, as a final coat and, and uh, that just kind of makes me feel better about how I can polish it up and that sort of thing. It's a great product. If you fight things being sticky in your office, this is the solution you're looking for. It's called Seam Free. It's from Vista Apex and it's a wonderful, wonderful material. I'm Dr. John Flukey. Thanks for watching.